Well, with weather reaching the closest you can get to triple, dig triple digits, it might be time to break out the boat and get out on the water. Our Parker King may have found the perfect spot for you to enjoy a summer weekend in another installment of A Walk in the Park with Parker. He's here to tell us about J.P. Coleman State Park. If you'd like the opportunity for an affordable stay out on the water while also seeing three states at the same time, look no further than J.P. Coleman State Park. And it's our next state park in a series of A Walk in the Park with Parker. Let's take a look. J.P. Coleman's been here since the mid-60s. Named after former Mississippi Governor James P. Coleman, this park offers a fun stay to all who visit. Their services may not involve biking or nature trails, but they make up for it with almost 48,000 acres of water known as Pickwick Lake. It's all about this lake. This is some of the best bass fishing, some of the cleanest water in the state, some of the cleanest water in the southeast. It's probably the best bass lake in the southeast. If you get tired of being out on the water, J.P. Coleman does have other outlets for everyone, some you may not expect a state park to have. We've got a mini golf course, we've got a swimming pool. If you like the park enough to stay for a weekend, J.P. Coleman Park Manager Gary Ray says there are places for campers of all kind to stay. We've got 69 campsites, we've got a motel room that's got 16 rooms and three townhouses. We got 20 cabins and three cottages. Some motel rooms are a little more like condos with downstairs living areas, a fully stocked kitchen, and two balconies to look out on the lake. These, along with the cottages and townhouses, have all the comforts of home. For large events, J.P. Coleman can accommodate crowds of over 100 people. First birthday parties to 100th birthday parties in, just a lot of different things. Assistant manager of J.P. Coleman, John Williams, tells us the park on the lakefront, combined with the reception hall, can make a great time for a certain special day. I've seen some really nice weddings. They'll have the weddings right out here, and then they'll come in here and have their receptions and have a good time. J.P. Coleman may give all these different experiences to visitors, but Ray tells us it also provides an escape from the usual sights and weather of Mississippi. This area is completely different than most of the areas in Mississippi. I, I say that this is almost like going to the mountains. Uh, the fall, it's beautiful. The foliage, it's it's different than any part of the state I've been to. This is probably the prettiest corner of the state that there is. His words, not ours. You might want to take a look for yourself and see if his words hold water. The park does for sure. And in this reporter's opinion, it's definitely a sight the camera can't do justice for. That'll do for us here. Be sure to tune in next time for another walk in the park. At J.P. Coleman State Park, Parker King, WCBI News. And of course, for information on rates, directions, and contact information, you can go to our website, wcbi.com.